Hello everyone, so today we'll be doing a couple of questions on the topic mutations, like you can see. So let's get into it. The first question reads, deamination in the DNA molecule may be due to 1. Ultraviolet radiation, 2. Viral mutagen, 3. Aflatoxin, 4. Methylation, 5. Nitrosamine. Okay, I'll give you some seconds to think. So when you look at this particular question, what are the correct answer is uh, nitrosamine. Okay, so in this case, the primary effect of the ultraviolet rays, you may have wanted to choose one, but what happens is that when, when the UV rays come, nitrosamines are the ones that actually produce, and those are the ones that cause deamination of the DNA. Uh, the DNA. Two, the primary effect of ultraviolet radiation is a production of A. Breaks in DNA. Two, base deletions in DNA. Three, pyrimidine dimers. Four, insertion of bases. Five, substitution of bases. So uh, what happens is that, uh, for instance, you have your son, if this is your DNA, so if these are these are the rays of light that are coming. So when DNA comes to this, uh, when uh, ultraviolet rays come to this particular portion of DNA, what happens is this. So I'm just going to take you straight to something like this. So the the rays will come right here, okay? So when the rays are exposed to this DNA. What happens is uh, thymine dimers are going to be produced, okay? So these thymine dimers are going to attach themselves. Hence, there will be no complementary base pairing. And that's how uh, that particular DNA is going to be distorted and mutation is going to occur. Okay? Okay, let's just erase this. Question 3. Which of the following human diseases is caused by UV radiation? 1. Lung cancer. 2. Liver cancer. 3. Skin uh, cancer. 4. Stomach cancer. 5. Pancreatic cancer. So the correct answer here is skin cancer. Okay. So the skin is more uh, exposed to the external environment. Okay. So when you look at these other options, these are organs that are found internally and they are caused by different causes okay and like the skin that's freely open to mutation for a point mutation can result from a one addition of a base to a dna sequence two replacement of one pyrimidine with another pyrimidine three loss of a base from a dna sequence four replacement of a purine from one purine with another purine, five of the above are correct. So when you look at point mutation, okay? So for instance, this is your DNA. What happens in point mutation is in one particular point of the DNA sequence is going to be changed, okay? And that's how the mutation is going to change. So it could be an addition of a base, could be a replacement of that particular base, could be a loss could be a replacement, hence the correct answer is all of the above are correct. Question 5. Nonsense mutation occurs when 1. A triplet codes for a different amino acid which is not functional. 2. A triplet codes for a different amino acid whose function is similar to the normal amino acid. 3. A triplet codes for a chain termination. 4. Both 1 and 2 are correct. 5, both 1 and 3 are correct. Okay, so I'll give you a short moment for you to actually uh, think about it. Hi, I hope you're enjoying the lesson that my colleague worked on in biology. So on our platform we have topics, past papers and tutorial questions as I make this video. So the topics videos allow you to learn the topics from scratch. Okay. Now at the end of each uh, topic, uh, let me give you an example of uh, of maybe carbohydrates. Okay. At the end of each topic, videos, uh, you'll be able to assess yourself with the quizzes. These are MCQs. 
based on the exam questions okay so which assess your your understanding okay so let me try to see where we could yeah so for example this says choose the incorrect statement okay you choose it'll be able to mark you okay that's a uh, one way of actually ensuring that you are learning then um uh, but in addition to these uh, topics videos and the quizzes that come after we also have past papers we've got a part where we've arranged them according to the topics okay by the time probably you're watching this video you're going to have over 10 of them 10 to over 10 topics because they're already being worked on as i make this then you also have other past papers arranged according to the years then um, the tutorial questions as well um kind of like the quiz uh, questions but then in video form as well just to practice each topic so with this yeah ready to prepare for biology exams and assessments that come your way okay so to sign up use the link in the description below